I'm sorry, but I just can't swallow oh, this right on, now. come on, darling. He's hung like a sperm whale, for pity's sake. How can you not feel the part? But, Stevie... Now's my star director. Oh, man, the struggle between mm. the artistic integrity and the humping, pumping action continues unabated. Mm. And before you ask, <laughs> yes, all four videos will be released mm. by their... Honey, can you please keep the Andacon in the shot? He costs more per hour than you do. Oh, sorry, Steve. I was thinking, we need some kind of big stunt to really promote the launch. Mm. Something that will make a real impact on this city. You got any ideas? Mm. Mm. Well, in the old days, they used to have gala events, stars, limos, the night sky crisscross with searchlights. Searchlights. I got an idea. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, little sequin numbers and the limos. Uh, oh, mm. premieres. Oh, yes, uh, ma'am. Of course, yeah. ma'am. And mm. the press and the barrage of lights. All we ask, and for that, you know everyone can be educated on the important things we discuss on VCPR. 10% is a really small amount. I remember when I was volunteering in Central America to make myself appear less shallow. The native peoples would give you 10% of their land for a pair of mirrored sunglasses. And they would run around me saying, chicle, chicle, which is Espanol for pretty woman. It was very spiritual, like waves. Absolutely. But remember, this radio station could disappear. The voice of unprofitable radio could be silenced. One day you wake up, roll over, and she's gone. You go into the kitchen, there's a note scrawled, the sound of a taxi leaving in the distance, a thunderstorm rolls in. It's a metaphor for my haircut, or this pledge drive. Yes, the pledge drive. Become a member. Only members, or people with radios, can listen to this radio station. Now back to pressing issues. Shouldn't we get off the phone number? Like I tell the children at the library I volunteer at, look it up yourself. No, you can't go to the bathroom and stop crying. That's good advice. Now, back to pressing issues. Welcome back to pressing issues with me, Maurice Chavez. On our panel, we got the secessionist lunatic John F. Hickory, liberal rich king Philip Brayshaw, and neo-fascist congressman Alex Trump. Gentlemen, welcome back. Let's start with you, Mr. Hickory. Why the F? For Florida. I'm a patriot. I've even got an orange grove tattooed all over my groin. Excellent. But back to the matter at hand. Public safety. How do we get guns under control in this city? By giving everyone hope. A dream of a better tomorrow. By encouraging people to grow their own root vegetables. What's the satisfaction of holding a gun in your hand when you could be holding a hoe, planting seeds in a peasant village? Keep your hoes and seeds to yourself. Well, if you read the Constitution, it's a sacred document that should not be changed. Under our Constitution, women couldn't vote, but the liberals come in crying crocodile tears. We need to get scaremongers and non-believers men like you, Chavez, under control. I've got a good mind to have your funding removed. We don't get any funding. Yeah, exactly. Well, good. <laughs> you won't see a penny out of me. You've got to stop spreading these lies or I'll whip you myself. And I'm not afraid. The Constitution asserts a man's right to bear arms uh, and arm bears and all points in between. Uh, whoever heard of a gun or a bear causing problems? This is all cocky pop or whatever that word is. It, it keeps the place safe. Trouble is caused by unemployment, and unemployment comes from poor economic performance and lazy... <laughs> graffiti and your name all over town and making a nuisance of yourself spinning on your back and popping and locking and not a hope it's simple if you don't have a job starve get out of my constituency by force if necessary and starve that is quite simple are you really saying that of course i am vice city is a growing city of course there are going to be some growing pains well what i tell people is this Gather up your life savings, buy yourself a piece of swamp, drain it, and get rid of the damn wildlife. Then apply for planning permission. Pretty soon you can have your own retirement community or resort destination holiday place. You can start making money out of the boom, the shrub-inspired boom, and enjoy the kind of things sensible people have. Personal bodyguards, massive fences, and a bigger collection of guns than the other guy. It stands to reason. No, 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 no! Keep them... If there are any old people listening, go back to your homes. Florida does not want you. Please, 
die somewhere else. What's wrong with Nevada or Kansas? We want a river. We need a river. The Freedom River. And what about the other crimes? It seems car crime, fashion crime, drugs, everything is on the rise. Absolutely. Of course it is. When I was in Uganda, people were poor, but they were happy. The more you have, the less you have. And that's kind of what I'm all about. Their satisfaction... Ah. I saw a great lake of sand and a massive speaking dog. It was a dog of love, not of hate. It was a spirit journey. What are you talking about? I'm talking about hopes, dreams, the magic of television, especially public television. Puppets can say what men cannot. Yes, but how will that stop people taking baseball bats and pounding the living crap out of each other as I saw in a mother's PTA group meeting recently? Baseball is our national sport, our national pastime. Mister, our national game down. Four radios all turned on to BCPR. A dog. Fifteen ice cubes. But I don't feel safe. I'm worried about gangs. Gangs are a myth. Put Tommy. Paolo here. Two packs for Mako. What do you want, Paul? I don't want any fake label clothes. Very funny, mate, but you know I don't touch bank gear. No, I was just calling to see if I could get a part in one of your movies. Back in England, I did a lot of blue stuff, mate. I'm packing more heat than you, my son. Paul, thanks for the offer. I'll bear that in mind. Seriously, don't forget about me. I feel all I've done for you. That's what I'm trying to forget about. <laughs> 